the Lord said you paid in the last season, you're going to reap in the next. Everybody that cried in the last season, I got you to give it glory right now. If you went through anything in the last season, I got you to shout right now for the... Your last season paid for the next one. What you cried about, you're about to dance for. Tell your neighbor, I cried for the next I cried over it in the last season. I'm getting ready to dance over it now. I tell you, open your mouth and scream like you're already in your next season. But I'm so glad today I can stand right here and say that the Lord been good to me. We didn't have much money. A lot of my friends thought it was funny. But I'm so glad today I can stand right here and say that the Lord didn't do it to me. Can I do it again? We didn't have much money. A lot of my friends thought it was funny. But I'm so glad today I can stand right here and say that the Lord did good to me. God, I wish I had a friend. Did good to me. Hey, we gotta get out of here.
one time, come on, say, I could have lost my mind, say, I could have lost my mind, I'm done, I wanted to give up, I wanted to give up, so many times, so many times. but God was my What's abandoned property to others is going to be it's going to be streams of revenue to you. It is almost as though they're going to give you the property for pennies on the dollar because it's distress to them, but it's going to be success to you. What's distress to others is getting ready to be success to you. I prophesy two words over your life, and if twelve people get it with you, they'll experience it by the end of May. Two words over your life, suddenly and immediately. Suddenly and immediately is going to happen in your life. And 12 of y'all need to praise God because that's going to be a sudden manifestation at your house. That's right.
season is falling off of you. You hear me? I don't know what this means. I'm literally looking at 2019, August, September, October. Whatever transpired in those three months in 2019, the Lord said the residue is still on you. But tonight the Lord says, I, I hear the Lord say self-blame. You got to stop blaming yourself. Because you're holding yourself hostage. Not because somebody's saying it, but because I hear it prophetically, there is more. You hear me? And the way you possess it with your hands is you must first see it in your mind. The first step to recovery is perceiving it in your mind. The residue of the last season is falling off of you. And I don't know what this means, but the Lord says, tell her this time when she prays, I'm going to shift the paperwork in her favor. He said, come on, I'm a horse shot. He said, when you pray this time, 